Hey, what's up, people? Michael here. If you want to partner your YouTube channel up, check out the link in the description. Coming up next, it's a welterweight showcase between Connor, Notorious McGregor, and former top contender, Nate Diaz. This outlaw from Stockton, California, Nate Diaz, the younger brother of longtime competitor Nick. Both men are black belts in Gracie Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Diaz loves to put on a show. He's very active with his striking, and if he gets his opponent to the mat, he has multiple ways to finish the fight. Nate Diaz, like his brother Nick, has devastating cardio, utilizes a long reach, outstanding, accurate boxing, and a world-class Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu game to go with it. Conor McGregor has taken the UFC by storm. In fact, he sold out the O2 Dublin in record time and is a true hero in his home country of Ireland. One of the most polarizing figures in the UFC today, the notorious one, believes that he will dominate inside the octagon for many years. Conor McGregor is one of the most creative and dynamic fighters in the UFC's featherweight division today. He is also one of the most loved fighters to ever come out of Ireland. Set to fight tonight here inside the MGM Grand Garden Arena. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Diaz is three years his elder. He is three inches taller. He will have a four inch reach advantage. With the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, a referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Is my the favorite. fight is finally here. We have been talking about this matchup for months. Both men ready to lay it all on the line. Ready to fight? Ready. Here go. we go! Tonight's main event is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. White trunks for Diaz. Black trunks for McGregor. Conor McGregor's opponent has the reach advantage tonight. What will he need to do, Joe, to get inside and be effective? He's got to utilize timing and footwork. He's got to figure out what the distance is where his opponent can hit him, and he's got to figure out the right time to move inside that distance. Big roundhouse kick. Joe, that's a perfect straight left. 
big front kick. Nice Nicely front kick. done. Joe, that's another solid kick. Nice job slipping the punch. McGregor with a strong hook to the body. And there's a takedown attempt. High kick. McGregor with a solid left kick to the body. Just over three now. Inside leg kick. Nice counter left hook. Oh, oh head kick. With the kick. Oh, combination. Hard jab. Vicious combinations. Big takedown. In the side control. Eight and mounts, the mount. Full mounts. Not good. Hip escape. Nice hip escape. He went right back to that position. He's going after an arm. He's controlling the forearm. Throws the other leg over the face. That arm looks locked up tight. And he's got the arm. This may be the end, Joe. He got it. That's and it. it is all over. An excellent job in setting up the arm bar and getting the tap. Let's check out the action on our fight replay. Let's take a look at the setup here. And one more time from this angle, we can see that arm bar locked in tight for the tap. And finally, one more time, no choice but to tap. With the official decision, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at three minutes, 53 seconds of the very first round. We find the winner by tap out, the no Notorious McGregor gets the submission victory here tonight.